after last week looking at the tank, wondering how she was going to manage the underwater shoot. And here we are, waiting with bated breath as she plunges herself into her worst nightmare. With flashing images, it's Katie. This is the real... <laughs> me. So far, this year has already been a roller coaster of emotions for Katie. You're full of s***. What's your name? full of s***. Juggling family life. You're putting bubbles on your face. <laughs> Woo! Unwanted press attention. <laughs> and a heartbreaking split from husband Alex. There's so many good things, but there's also so many bad things that I can't see just resolving, to be honest. Join us as we continue to witness the drama. I didn't know it was a big pull. It's a good dance. It's so silly. Indulge in the glamour. Cheers. Cheers. And get into the nitty gritty. When I first met Alex, I always think people are after something with her, so I never get too attached to people. As we get up close and personal, I'm on my way to the solicitors to sort out me and Alex. With Katie. Late January, and Katie is off on business to the Alpine Resort of Clusters, Winter Playground to the Royals. It's also a good opportunity to escape the press attention since last week's announcement of her split from Alex. Oh, I love the fire! Have we got a lot of logs for the fire? Look at all these! The kids are all That is so cool! I've been staying for a while. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Where do I go first? Yeah. Oh, oh it's a fire in the yes. bedroom. Oh, yes. That's the bedroom. This is my bedroom, and the kids can go next door. This could be my mum and dad's room. They're so, getting old now, so they can have the crack in the bed. Uh, Are you a good skier? Yeah, I'm quite a good what skier. What do you do, ski or snowboard? Only skiing. What will I find easier, because I haven't done anything? I think then probably snowboarding is a bit easier. You think? Oh, really? Off. Yeah. Are you going to come with us? If you want to, of course. <laughs> yeah, you could be the instructor. I would love to. <laughs> After a quick house tour, it's not long before Katie's feeling right at home. I've got my swimming costume in it. But I'll have to go naked. Do you three come here all the time? Yeah, we'll be actually doing like that. Oh, brilliant. Doing the housekeeping. Oh, do you? <laughs> oh, brilliant. Do you do it in a... Um, nothing? <laughs> <laughs> do you wear an apron? <laughs> no, I'm, I'm joking. I am joking. <laughs> well, we're gonna have fun here. Isn't it good? Yeah. The kids are coming tomorrow. The Pricey family are on their way. <laughs> hey! <laughs> I actually think I'm gonna like skin. Good. Because I know I'm gonna be good. I can feel it in my bones. Here's to a nice weekend. Ching. Woo! After a restful night's sleep, Katie seems to already be loving mountain life and the chalet staff. We are very lucky ladies. We wake up, we've got our three musketeers here. Brilliant. Young, young men. And they said, do you want me to make your breakfast? We're like, what, you can cook? They, they can cook. You don't get that often these days, do you? I just printed the weather report for today. Oh, brilliant. The weather is fog and high clouds. Highs near minus seven degrees are possible. Really? At some point, we'll have to go up that lift to the top of the mountain well, just to come it. back let's, down let's again. Let's just do it today. I'm just worried that you bite enough more than you can chew, do you know what I mean? If you get up there and go, ah! Oh, I'm not saying I'll ski down. You, you think I'm going to ski down that mountain? Well, no, not that one, but an easier one. 
My face doesn't move. <laughs> I know, I can't tell what you're thinking. <laughs> I've got Botox here, I'm like that. <laughs> Sorry. <Something. laughs> Ready? Hi, Cyril. <laughs> Subtle as ever, Katie tries to make a good impression. Yeah, just... You just oh. don't need to clean up. Oh, okay. That's okay. Oh, <laughs> I'll just set up in a little bit. Arrange the massage. Oh, yeah. Mm. You did it. <laughs> <laughs> I was joking. <laughs> I was joking. <laughs> you didn't say that quite. So if, you, if you need a, anything, we'll be upstairs. Thank you. Okay. Thank Thanks. you. That's such a big mouth. You don't understand everything. <laughs> you have gone red. I can't, there's no way Botox doesn't allow you to go red. It is gorgeous here. I feel like I'm in a different world. I've got so many dramas going on at home at the moment. Yeah, does it calm you down? It does. So I can switch off. There's no paparazzi. And it's like, I'm in a, it's just no pressure. So I've left my phones back at the chalet. I know my mum's safe, I know they're all going to be looked after to come here. I'm just, yeah, there's dramas, but I can switch off, if that sort of switch off, if that makes sense. During her stay, Katie's been invited to attend and sponsor the prestigious annual Berenberg Ice Polo Competition. We invited Kate because we want to bring um, the snow polo tournament or polo in general to a much wider range of audience. And Kate's a brilliant way to do that. She's a worldwide known celebrity. If people discover polo through Kate, then I think that's a great thing. And horse lover Katie can't help but have a go herself. But it seems polo is much trickier than anything she's done before. Um... I can hold it like dressage style, on <laughs> but not polo. You take the top reins here, yeah, and you, if you put your hand like that, yeah, and then you put the top set between your thumb and the first finger, and then the second set there. Are okay, you ready? Put my hand, your hand. That's it. That's yeah? it. You got that. Perfect. And I hold that just so like that. Take your... yeah. I'm always thrown in the deep end, I am. You are. Jeez. Let's hit the ball. A little bit. <laughs> okay. I want to hit the ball and I try and pick things up quick. I can ride the horse, but I'm still not, it's still an animal and I'm still not used to the sport. So if you actually watch the guys, they're proper like this, out, whoa, like this. <laughs> and I'm like, whoa, I won't just, you know when they're all huddling together, I'm sort of, no, I'll, I'll stand back a little bit. I could be cocky and get in there, but I know I'll get hurt. So, and, you know, I don't know the rules of polo. I've got it all to learn and I am going to learn. I can't wait. I think she's a little bit nervous, but excited. It's good. Thank you very much. That was brilliant. I, I must have used every muscle in my body for that. Jesus. Coming up, Katie hits the slopes, literally. You're laughing at me. The Pricey family have their say. When I first met Alex, I like him, but I always think people are after something with her. It's sad, but I'm not interfering. And her childhood fear catches up with her. I have got a real big phobia of water. Look no, pathetic. Don't look up. Don't. Oh, it's so silly. Katie has flown out to the exclusive resort of Closters. And what holiday would be complete without a spot of shopping? Just a question. Yep. The stuff that I can hire, does any of it come in like pink? That's not a. But white's good because it will go with my jacket accurate. and I've got a horse stuff on it, but my outfit is black and white with pink in it. What skis do I use? Nice, easy ski. Yeah. What colour? Black, white. Per black, your yeah, black's perfect. Black is perfect. You can't do it for the colour, you've got to do what is right for you. Do what goes with my outfit. I told you I'm going to be all the gear, but no idea. Which of the lights is the easiest? The easiest? This one. All oh, the ugly. 
I knew yep. you were going to say that. Yep. What, what's the difference with them and them? That's uh, the big difference. That's shorter. They're much easier. It's the better ski. Um, we've got to go for the better ski. <laughs> Okay. Bye. Bye. Okay. Yeah. Bye bye. Thank you. Sorry. Let's just take the other car. We can. We can take them in. We can. Hold on. Let me have a look. Sit around that. Okay. Or slightly common. <laughs> Back at the chalet, and Katie is raring to go. You know the, the mountain. One at the top would be Don't great. tell me people do that. Yeah, I did it once. Are you serious? No way. <laughs> Jesus, you're good then. Yeah, I'm quick. Oh God, what is it, Reverend? I'm so good around here. <laughs> um, I'm gonna surprise you all. Don't you worry. Come in, folks. It's going to show our professional ski talent. Every year, tens of thousands of skiers visit Klosters to explore some of the finest slopes in Europe. And this year, Katie has set her sights on her biggest challenge yet. The nursery slope. She goes for the easy option. <laughs> At the end of a hard day skiing, Katie relaxes in style. Sort of. Meanwhile, the Pricey family has landed, and there's only one topic on their mind. When I first met Alex, um, I like him, but I always think people are after something with her, so I never get too attached to people around her. The trouble with Kate, she, when she does fall in love, she gives all. She gives all in one hit, and then it all backfires on her. It's sad, but I'm not interfering. I'm not taking sides. I'm not being biased. It's just what they decide to do between them, and that's the way it should be. I don't like reading about it in the paper because, you know, they're also biased one day, biased the next. You know, you've got some say this, some say that, you know. It's a load of rubbish, all of that. It's just that two people just at the moment can't get on, and that's it. My, I think Kate's future now is forget about meeting anyone, concentrate on the work, do the work, have a bit of fun in the meantime, relax, enjoy. And that's exactly what she did. It's the morning after the night before, and with the family looking after the kids, Katie has hit the tiles and the headlines. Feeling a bit delicate, she heads to the polo and deals with it the way anyone would. Dark glasses, a strong brew, 
and shying away from the cameras. It's the last night of the Berenberg Polo Competition and the elite world of polo gathered to celebrate in style. And there's a buzz of anticipation surrounding Katie's arrival. How many people of her age actually sponsor something to help children? It's brilliant. I think it's great she comes to Closters, and Closters are really happy to have her here. It would be awfully rude not to have one of them. Oh, it would be vulgar. It would be awfully rude. We can't have a repeat of last night, though. <laughs> Being up here, the... Uh, the air. Yeah. The bubbles sort of get you a little bit. So it's business as usual for Katie on her last night before returning to England. There's no trouble tonight, trust me, I'm not drinking. That was the last night. Well, I say I'm not drinking, holding it. A... It was fun yesterday. Oh, it was fun. Cheers. 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 Back in England, and Katie has some personal matters she must deal with. So this is quite a sad day for me, to be honest. I'm on my way to the solicitors to sort out things about me and Alex. I'm just hoping that Alex isn't going to be going after money and I hope he's the honourable man that we all know him as. Do you know what I mean? It's just awful. It's just put me off marriage completely. And I know everyone blames me, but no one knows the ins and outs of anything. So they just believe what they read. But me coming here today is not nice at all. Do you know, I, I really, and you know, and I said this to Alex, I just don't want to be married, I don't want a relationship, I haven't got time for a relationship anymore. I don't, I don't want to give time for a relationship. I just want to concentrate on my kids. Um, and just my career, I want to be selfish. I've always been in relationships. And they obviously don't agree with me at the minute. Right, I think it's that one, stop a set. Is it that one? No, I think it's the next one. Yes. For legal reasons, cameras can't be present during the discussions, so Katie is left alone for the afternoon. Returning to work over in Buckinghamshire, Katie is at the world-famous Pinewood Studios, home to the James Bond films, a 100-strong crew have gathered to film an underwater Sky TV promo. Starring Price, Katie Price. There's just one tiny problem. I have got a real big phobia of water. So I even went in my swimming pool at home and was just swimming under the water, which I haven't done. I put, you know, the swimming, the swimming hat on goggles as it took me back to when I was 14 in the water, because I haven't done that since I was 14 just to see what I'd be like. So I was under the water talking to myself. So I was all right then, so hopefully oh, well, I'll be all right. fine. That's all you've got to do it's today. Just, it's yeah. your mind. It's, it's yeah. a mind thing. We're, we're not feeling very deep at all tonight. So it's just the fact of being under the, the water, yeah. yeah. yeah right. Yeah. But there's a platform, so you can probably just stand up straight away yeah. and feel anything. Yeah. We'll have a fun day. Lovely. Thank you. Coming up, can Katie conquer her fear of the water? I didn't know it was a big pool. Look at the fence no, it was so deep. Will her fashion range meet her expectations? Oh, my God! Look at it all. Oh, my God, she's going to be here all night. And has Gary finally lost it? I never, ever want to see your f***ing hair again. Back at Pinewood Studios, the crew are preparing for the underwater shoot. And Katie is preparing to face her fear of water. Ready to go. Gonna walk. Okay. <laughs> But her fear is worse than she first thought. Okay. 
go somewhere else. I didn't know it was a big pool. There's a platform that you're on. No, pathetic. It's no, no, it's so it's, deep. You know, it's, it's from an old. I'll be all right there with my face is up, but when I go under, I'm... This is so close, I haven't been in a big pool like this. Katie's going to need expert help to overcome her fear. I think it's either with Kate, with anyone who has anxieties or immune to this kind of thing, I think the best thing to do is to take it at their pace and very slowly, obviously one and one on one. It's all about repetition, it's all about familiarity, uh, getting used to new equipment and a new environment. Blast out. So this is not okay. This is go up, this is go down. If you have a problem, this is the signal for a problem. Sorry, point to the problem. With all eyes on Katie, the pressure is mounting for her to perform underwater, especially with her childhood memory resurfacing. I know it's such a big issue for me and you lot were thinking, what, what on earth are you all about? Well, basically, when I was 14, I used to swim for Sussex and train four times a week. And all I remember, I was doing it and I thought, am I dreaming this or am I swimming? And I just couldn't move my... I felt like I was being pulled under. And they pulled me out and I couldn't move my legs. It was like they were paralysed. And then from then, I had really bad panic attacks and then nightmares that I was drowning. So I haven't really been swimming much since. With the help of the professional divers, Katie manages a few test dives. I'm OK, thank you. But to get the shot for the photographer, she'll need to go a lot deeper. I can swim. I'm gonna try it again. It's my son. No one's telling me to do it, so it's better. Just not gonna look down. Five, please. Roll camera. Speed. And action. Finally, she does it. With her confidence peaking, Katie is producing some great results. That's fantastic. Shots are really beautiful, they're amazing. It's demanding for anyone, really, I think, having to spend.